Hi everyone, this is Lisa from Happy Hook Creations. And um, today is Friday, <laughs> or Friday. I don't have a lot to show you, but um, I did a couple more rows of the blanket yesterday. And I wanted to show you that at least. And I know my hair is just like, and I also have two hats that I made. Now I made these hats a minute ago. I, I don't know if I showed them to you or not. I might have when I showed you my red hat that I've made. So um, we're gonna do, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> so, oops. So as you know, I've just had kind of a crazy week. Um, glad it's over. Um, you know, we've had some, some uh, things that we were dealing with and I had company. It was just crazy. So, <laughs> so anyway, I'm trying to get back to normal. And I just thought, man, it's Friday. I haven't really shown you guys anything. So um, I'm looking around and yeah. So I am going to show you some more of the blanket and then two hats that I finished that I think I took pictures of on TikTok, but I didn't show them to you. So I do apologize for that. Um, I haven't done anything to the dress yet either. Sweet. I'll get around to it this weekend. We're supposed to have a wintry mix of something and I'm not going anywhere. So this is the Ocean Waves crochet pattern that there is a tutorial on, on Bag of Day crochet. Miss Crystal. So <laughs> let me get this ready. And I know I didn't have this much done. I'm trying to think. Let's see. I remember when I first showed it to you guys, I had like maybe two rows done. And I think I did six more rows since then. So here's what it's looking like. And it's really pretty. It's really pretty. So this weekend, I'm finally going to get to sit down, put an old classic movie on. I think I'm going to watch. Um, oh, man, I had it right in my head, too. Oh, well, it'll it'll come to me. <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, yeah, that Hamilton lady or that Hamilton woman. Vivian Lee is in it. So I'm going to watch that. And um, I'll probably watch classic movies and crochet all day. I'm going to have food in the crock pot. And yeah, so I'll have time. Abby is not here this weekend. She is off. Um, running around with her brother. So, <laughs> and Jack is working. So I have the house all to myself tomorrow. So this is just really pretty. I will link the tutorial in the description box below if, if no one has tried making this. Super easy, you guys. And with it being chunky, it works up really fast. So I really want to get this done this weekend. And this is, I mean, look at how much I still have left over. So, you know, it uses up yarn, but it's, I mean, it's going to be a decent size. It's going to be a decent size. And I keep it in my handy dandy copy paper box. Look at how great that fits in there. It's just, just fold it up and just kind of sit it in there. Yeah. So that's it. <laughs> that's my, that's my one thing that, um, I still have to work on and I'm looking around. I'm working, that's a totally different video though, but I, I also have my uh, Hobie item done and I have my, oh, what is it? My Hobie item, that's complete, but I have to do that separate. And then I also have, oh, there we go. My yarn challenge or mystery yarn, my yarn, mystery yarn challenge, um, January, 2023. And that is being hosted by Lori of the Armchair Chef. So, um, yeah, I have that item done as well. So I'll be doing a video and then sending it to her and then she'll put it in a playlist and then you guys will get to see it. It's really exciting. I made something totally different. Not totally, but something different for me. Because, you know, I like hats. So speaking of which, if I didn't show this to you, I, th I think I did. So you, this, is, this might be on repeat mode, you guys, but I love it so much. <laughs> so yeah, I might have shown you this already. Okay, this is the yarn. I cannot remember the name, but I received this for Christmas and the hat, it was a kit. And well, maybe this one wasn't a kit. I think I just found this. I just knew I had a pom-pom that went with it. I'm not sure. But um, yeah, 
I love this hat. I do. I love it. I love it. And there's my tag. These are my old cork tags that I got from, I think it's called the Beach Company. They're, I, I got them specifically. Um, this gentleman's shop is located in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And that's where I was living when I met my husband. That's where our daughter was born. So um, our daughter, Amanda, she was born there. So, <laughs> so yeah, so there's that one. I just thought it was worth it. Even if you've seen it already, I thought it was worth another look. And then um, the green one, you guys remember, I was like, oh man, totally in love with this green hat. I want to put this on so bad, but I'm not going to because I have a big head and lots of hair. But this is the divine hat. I think I showed you that I was making a divine hat. There's like a glare right there. It's driving me crazy. But look at that pom-pom. Isn't it great? And then I just did three rows of, it's like single. Yeah, three rows of single crochet. This one is, yeah, this is another, I think I had four of them left. Four of this particular one. I have, I've already ordered more. I got some from another company, but um, those were a gift. I, I think I want to, I like the cork a lot. So I'll probably get more of them. But this, man, this merino wool is just beautiful. And it's such a rich, can you guys see just how, I don't know if that's helping or hurting, but I thought maybe if I, oh, now I just totally messed it up. There, maybe you can see how rich and that green color is so yeah i'll be listing these in my shop uh man i just really love it these pom-poms you guys i'm telling you just amazing just amazing um and i do have one i think i showed you this one so i'm gonna i haven't started it yet but it's gonna be part of my um i'm taking it out of its bag right now uh oh i just dropped the all right, so it has a snap on. Oh, I hope I didn't drop the little snappy part. Hey, I don't think I have the the other part to that. Oh, well, it has to be here, right? Because there's this yarn, and I will be doing this one. Indicita. So that's... Look at how beautiful that is. So this will probably, I think this is like 90, is this 90 yards? Let me see. Yeah, so I'm going to make this one like I made the red hat. Now this one isn't as big as I would like. It, they came together. Um, I mean, I, I see it. I guess I see it. I like big fluffy pom-poms. This is a beautiful color though. So yeah. So this is my, I, I keep my red hat. So this red hat was in the same category. This red one that I made is in the same category as this one. So it'll probably look like this. I love my hat. This is my hat. And I'm not giving it to anybody. <laughs> this is my hat and it's going to remain my hat. So I get to wear it today. Yay. Um, yeah, so this one, this is definitely going to be a make and a finish, but... Um, it's the super bulky Rasta 90 yards, but you see what I mean? So that's supposed to go on top. There are, there's some color in there because I was looking, I'm like, why did it come with this? But I get it. I mean, I, I see. Hopefully when I get in there and get it untwisted and ball it up, um, we'll be able to see it more. And there's another one that I'm going to make a hat out of. Uh, let's see. There it is. The purple. You guys remember this? I couldn't find it for a while because it got, it was missing in action. Um, it was, oh, that would have been really cool. Oh, look it. I know that's a lot of purple, but can you really have too much purple? No, you cannot. There's never too much purple. There's no such thing. So this one came with a black one, remember? I remember it came with, I don't know where the bag is, but it came with a black pom-pom. So when I'm done making the hat and it, this one, is in the same category. This is the the Mecca. So this is the same category as this one. So I will probably, and it used all the yarn to make this hat. So I'll probably do the same thing with this one. I think it would look really nice. I love that it's, you know, it's textured. It's, 
uh, it looks really good. So I do like it. And I think, I think I'll do the same with the purple one. So I'm not sure if I'm going to put the black pom-pom on it, but I'm definitely going to make a hat. And hmm, not sure about this pom-pom. And, and it's supposed to, maybe it's attached and I just don't see it. Let me see. Yep. It's on there. Okay. So that's what, that's what I don't use snaps. I usually use buttons. So, but let me put this back on here before I lose it. So you sew it on and then just attach it. Eh, can't be that bad, right? If you guys, what do you guys prefer? Do you prefer to use the snap on method or the button method? Let me know. Cause I'm just curious like that. Ah, all right. I'm going to go. I'm going to get off here. I know that's not a lot, but boy, next week you guys are going to be in for it. I'm going to have whips and I'm going to be working on stuff this weekend. I want to finish this blanket. So that's, that's my top priority is getting that blanket finished. Um, and then if I can get these hats made, then I'll get them made. If I can get them started, that'll just be something to show you next week. Um, but yeah, so it's time for dinner. I'm getting ready to make, um, Dijon mustard sauce over mushrooms and onions over pork chops and then maybe some broccoli or diced potatoes or something so <laughs> we'll, we'll see how it turns out i haven't made it in a while um <clears throat> but i used to make it all the time and i keep the so like when you get those hello fresh or hello fresh yeah yeah i keep the the recipe cards um, they have like these big eight by 10 recipe cards that tell you all the ingredients that you need. And, uh, Jack and I received that as a gift from Amanda one year. She got us, um, I think it was an eight week program or six weeks or something. I know it like every week we received a box. So it was really nice, but I kept all the cards. So it was really cool. So I just go and get the stuff and that's, so that's what we're having. It's based on one of those. And, um, I'll let you know what it, what it tastes like because it's been it's similar to something that I made from HelloFresh this one's every plate but we'll see anyway I know that's not yarn related but I just thought I gotta go start dinner <laughs> so yeah I'll be doing that anyway that's it thank you guys so much for um your kind comments I appreciate them um Jack appreciates them everyone reads the comments uh I try to respond to all of them but um <laughs> Believe me, I read them all. So I do appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. And um, yeah, if it's your birthday, because mm -hmm, it's probably someone's birthday out there, happy birthday to you. If it's your anniversary, happy anniversary to you both. If it's cold where you are, please stay warm. Uh, snuggle up on that couch with one of your makes maybe or a blanket um, that someone gifted to you. And, you know, watch your favorite show on TV. Enjoy your family. Enjoy your family. <laughs> and if um, it is cold where you are, stay warm. No, that's wrong. If it's really warm where you are, stay cold <laughs> or cool, whichever you prefer. Because some people don't mind the heat. I don't mind it. Um, but I'd like to be able to go into air conditioning when I get too hot and I'm tired of it. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> so wherever you are. Stay warm or stay cold. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. And remember, you can not only find me on YouTube, but you can also find me on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Pinterest. Um, links will be in the description box below. So you can just click on that and follow me. And I think it's follow and like. And on YouTube, is the, I think YouTube is the only one that subscribes, but... I do appreciate you guys so much for doing that. And also thank you for heading over to my Etsy shop and favoriting some of my items because it really does help. And that is in the description box below as well. All right, I'm going to get off here now. <laughs> I think I'm going to wear my hat the rest of the night because I really like it. It makes me happy. All right, talk to you later. I'll see you when I see you. Happy hooking. Bye, guys. <laughs>